again um yeah I'm back on the field next to the roman field i'm gonna i'm probably gonna do half i've got a whole day today so i'm gonna do half a day here and half a day on the actual roman field where i have more luck so yeah you can see what i find on this big field again at 60 70 acres wherever it was um yeah hopefully we'll actually find some decent stuff this time i mean last time we found a few bits but i just want to try and find the find the hot spot this time so yeah i'll see you on the first decent target guys see you in a bit the first one guys I think it's a little closed fastener, it's got a little hook on the back. Not sure, it could be something like that. It could be possibly maybe um, Georgian or Victorian or something, I don't know. Yeah, it's pretty cool. About the third target in. It's pretty cool. Alright, so the next one. Oh, there you go guys, the next one. Little livery button. Don't know which one it is, but it's got a couple of horses on there, a little shield in the middle. Looks like it would have been a pretty nice one actually. I'm not sure. Definitely some sort of library button there. Nice one. Alright, see you on the next one, guys. Alright, next one's down here, guys. Got a nice sounding signal. Try and do it live. This ground's a lot better than what it was last week. Now it's been rolled. Alright, it's out. Yeah, I think it's just a piece of rubbish. A little bit of lead. It's always lead on live digs, isn't it? Oh well. Alright, see you on the next one. Alright guys, just got this one laying on the surface. Uh, really not sure what it is, but it's got some nice detail on it. This bit of pewter. So it's got this sort of pewter colour to it, but I don't know, it's got nice detail though. Some nice design on there. I don't have a clue what that is. Anybody who knows, put it in the comments for me. God knows. That's pretty nice though. Alright, I'll see you on the next one. Right, I think we've got the first coin of the day, guys. This one here. I think it's a coin, not a button. Yeah. I think it's a little battered penny of some sort, maybe George or Victoria. Yeah, it's completely gone. I think it would have been Victoria actually. It's about to make our head there, but yeah, it's knackered. Completely toasted. Oh well, that's it. Oh, guys, got a bit excited for a second now. Thought I'd found a silver coin, but it's a little button. Quite a nice one actually. I don't know what that is, it's some sort of dragon or something, I don't know. It's pretty cool though. Nice one. All right, see you on the next one. All right, guys, next one is down there. I can see it almost on the surface. You see it? See it behind there? I don't know if it's a coin or a button. Oh, looks like a coin. Oh, it looks like an old one as well, actually. What is that? Um, yeah, I'm not sure what that is. It looks quite, looks thin like a hammered. It might be like, it's got a red colour to it, so it might be like a comp copper, some sort of copper hammered or something. I'll try and give it a little clean up and try and find out what it is, but I've got a feeling it's just going to deteriorate as soon as I try and clean it, but I'll give it a little squirt and I'll get back to you. I was giving it a bit of a squirt, but I can't, can't seem to get anything off it. I don't know what it is, to be honest. It, Sort of got that, looks really thin, like a hammered, but it's copper. I don't know, probably is some sort of modern coin, maybe Victorian or something. 
and I can't get anything off of it, so oh, I don't know. Alright, I'll see you on the next one, guys. Got this one. And what does that look like? Like a little lead frog. That's a bit weird. I don't know if it would have been like a top on something. I don't know. You see that little lead frog? <laughs> I had a lead horse off of this field last week, so God knows what was going on up here. But yeah, definitely a little, looks like a little frog to me. A little bit on the bottom, I reckon it would have sat on top of something. <laughs> Alright, cool. Alright, moving on. You guys, looks like I've got another little coin. It's probably going to be a George or a Vicky or something. Don't know bad condition actually this one for a change. What's that? 1916, so George. Is that George V? Yep. Yeah. Yep, yeah, little George V coin. George V penny, I think. Cool, it's quite good condition apart from being bent up. But details are all on that. George V. Alright, see you on the next one. I've got another um, coin or button situation in the clod. See if we can. I reckon that's a button actually, to be honest. I'm not sure. Looks a bit too. I'm not sure, do I? I don't think it's either actually. Is it? What is it? Oh no, it's a button. Yeah. A chunky one. Yeah, definitely got something on there, but I can't tell what it is. Right, on to it. Right guys, just got this one. Looks like it could be interesting. Could be a coin, I think. Could even be a Roman, I'm in the right spot. Where the Romans were last time. Oh no, done me again. The bloody button. Ah. Oh well, right, on to it. I think I just caught a little Roman, a little Roman sunbathing. That's what it is, isn't it? Yep. Totally battered one, but yeah, a little Roman just sitting on the surface. That's a good sign. Hopefully, we'll find some more. I don't think we can get anything off that. Nah. All right, see you on the next one. All right, guys, got another good one here. Nice banging signal. Could be too good to be true. Yeah. Oh, just drop this bait. Let's have a look. And it's a button. Yep, yeah, definitely a button. Oh well, on to the next. Oh guys, this one, there's another one just on the surface. Just there. Let's see what it is. Oh, I don't know what that is. Sorry, I'm trying to keep it out of the wind. I don't know, that looks interesting. It's definitely got some sort of writing or well, some sort of design anyway around the around the edge. So it looks pretty cool. To try and clean it up a bit and I'll see what it is. Right, see you on the next one. Alright guys, I think it would have been quite a nice buckle, but unfortunately I just broke it. <laughs> I put a bit too much pressure on it and that snapped. But I think it would have been quite a nice little buckle to be honest. Some nice detail on there. Oh well, it's a broken buckle now. <laughs> See you on the next one. Next one guys, little spectacle buckle. Not a bad one, quite good condition. Right, moving on. Another one that could possibly be a buckle I think. I thought it was silver at first but I don't think it's got the weight. Don't feel heavy enough to be silver. Yeah, I don't know. I'll do the silver test when I get home, but I don't think it is. It could be a little buckle. 
pretty cool. All right, moving on. Sounds like a good signal. Very nice clean signal. Could be a coin. Or it might be a bit of lead or something. But... Yeah, this one here. Um, I don't know, it could be a coin. Let's see. Oh, yeah. A little Roman. Oh, I don't know, actually. It could be a button, actually. That side looked like it could be Roman. And then that side looks like it could be a button. So I'm not sure. I think I'm going to go with button on that one. Yeah, we'll go with button. Alright guys, got another one, could be a coin. Just flicked it out. Mm, looks like it could have been a coin at some point. Can't tell what it is. Not sure if it's another little Roman or not, to be honest. Or, hmm, I don't know, it's so thin, it's got nothing left on it. Could have been something on that side. I uh, can't make it out. Oh well. On to right, guys, just got this one. If you can see it, I just pinpointed it. And I thought it looked like it had a bit of silver to it, so I thought I'd better stop and get the camera up. Yeah, that's silver. It's a little sixpence, isn't it, I think. Is it sixpence? Oh, I don't know actually. What is it? I think it might be f some sort of foreign coin or something. It's very light. Oh no, it's George. It is a sixpence, isn't it? That's what I thought it was. Oh, I don't know. It looks too thin to be a sixpence, but it is, isn't it? Nope. Ah, it's, uh, it's a threepence. That's why. Yeah. yeah it's 1920, I think. George V again. It's alright, I haven't had one of them before, that's why I didn't recognise it. Alright, there you go. It's getting a bit windy. See you in a bit. This next one, guys. It's like part of a buckle. Would have been quite a nice one. Yeah, it took me ages to find. I've already pinpointed it. It was right in the sidewall. I've been digging and digging, and I realised it was in the sidewall. So, yeah, well, fun times. See you in a bit. Here we go, guys. Got another little sunbather. It's like a coin this time. Little Vicky. That'd be a half penny, I think. Yeah, a little half penny. What's that? Can't see the year. 18. Can't see it now. 1862, I think. Cool. Little, little Vicky half penny. It's definitely a Victorian part of the field I'm on at the moment. Can't seem to find much older than that around it. Right, see you in a bit. Guys, halfway through the hunt. Um, I'm going to go on to the Roman field now. I think I've had enough of that for today. Just started finding lots of lead, really, loads and loads of lead. So I think I'd fancy, well, I can hear the Romans calling me, I think. So I'm going to go to the Roman field for about three hours. I think I've done just over five hours on that field now. Um, let me just I've got, got a few nice bits. I've got a George V penny, little frappence. George V Thruppence, not too bad. 
That's how you say it, threepence, threepence. Never actually had one of them before, so that's the first. Um, yeah, a few little bits. Those, that little coin there, I'm not sure what it is, to be honest. Thought it might have been some sort of copper, copper hammered, maybe. I'm not sure. Possible Romans over there. I think those two are Romans there. Well, I'm not 100% on that one. Possibly Roman. Yeah, a few little bits. Oh, my little, little lead frog as well. So yeah, got a few nice bits off of there. A little buckle there. But yeah, so I'm going to go head to the Roman field now. So finish it off with a few Romans, hopefully. All right, I'll see you on the next one, guys. Sorry about the wind, but it's a bit windy up here. Um, yeah, second target on the Roman field. And it's another little surface find. Could be another little Roman. I reckon it is. Um, alright. Yeah, I reckon that's another little grotty Roman. Don't think there's much on that one again. Nope, that's it though, straight on the Romans. Alright, let's go and buy some more. Another one on the surface. Right there. Let's see what that is. Um. I reckon that might be like the end of a spoon or something or a fork. Yeah, that's what my guess is. Looks like some some detail on there though. I'll see if I get it cleaned up, I'll put a picture on after this. See you next. Alright guys, just pinpointed the next one. It's right there. It's like another little grotty moment. So I've walked straight back into another little hot spot. Same again though, no details. Alright, on to the next one guys. Got loads of surface finds today. You can see it there. I haven't actually looked at it yet. Yeah, I don't know what that is. It's just a button I think, yeah it is, isn't it? Yeah, I've seen one of them before. I should get it out. Yeah, just a button. Got excited for a second. Oh well. Bloody silver buttons. Right, see you in a bit. Right, guys, I just got this one. Little dog said. God knows what that is. Must be part of some piece of furniture or something, probably. And it's pretty cool, though, little dog said. Split down the middle. <laughs> right, on to the Just flick the next one out. It's out the hole. Down here somewhere. In there. Just a piece of crap, I think. Can I get it out on set? Right, guys, I've had a bit of a fight with a clod, but I managed to get it out in the end. It's there. Uh, it's a little Roman, Roman minim. A tiny one. I thought it was just a bit of rubbish, but I think it is actually some sort of Roman coin. Alright, on to next. Alright guys, next one is in there somewhere. It's a bit of a messy signal. It's not very clean, but give it a go. See if I can actually find it. It's somewhere around here. I think it's up here somewhere. Right. It's in there somewhere. 
up right was it? Well, I was having a right nightmare with that one, but I managed to bang it out of the clod in the end. And it flicked over here. And there it is. Another tiny little one. These were a nightmare to find when they get stuck in these big hard clods. But yeah, I got it in the end. Smash it open on the spade. But yeah, tiny little minimum again. Right, on to the next. Oh, this one's a bit... Some ways it sounds like a little nail, in some ways it sounds quite good. So, let me give it a go. Still in there. in that big boulder. Uh, signal's gone now. I think it might just be in there somewhere. Lead. Right, on to the next. Hi right, guys, what next one? Um, I thought it was on the surface, but I can't see it now. No, it sounded like it was on the bloody surface as well. Oh, it was still in the hole. I think it's out now, though. Yep. Sounds a bit better, actually. In the clod. Was that it there? Ah, oh, that's... Ah, oh, a piece of modern crap. Maybe something off a tractor or something. Crap. Right, here's the next one. Sounds like a nice clean signal. Do a live one. Just got it up. Let's move that out of the way. It's still in there. Think it's out. Should be. Here and there somewhere. Alright, so here's the next one guys. In the clod. Looks like another little Roman. Yep, there we go. Another little one. Just trying to get some with some detail on today, that'd be nice. Or a nice silver one, that'd be good. I've got about an hour and a half left, I think. So hopefully we get something good. Alright, see you all in the Guys, looks like we're on a roll. So we've got another one. be 
you a slight bit of detail on there. Yeah, you can see the. I'll get it in the light. Does that make out Roman's head there? I think. A little bit of detail, though. not too bad. Better than the other ones I've had. Right, see you in the next. Right, there's the next one, guys. Another little Roman. You can just about make out two figures there, standing with the, um, with the standard in the middle. And that's where the head would be, but that's completely gone. There's a tiny bit of detail though. Better than some of the others. I didn't show the last one because it was so bad, so I'll just I'm gonna start to fill up the whole video with grots. Right, I'll see you on the next one. Okay, guys, there's the next one. I'm not sure what it is. It looked like a Roman coin, but I don't know, because it's got some detail on there, but it looks a bit weird. I don't know if it's someone standing there or if it's an animal that way around. Definitely something. And on the other side, it's just a hole. And it might even be like a button or something. It's a really old button, maybe. I don't know. Well, it could be that way. It looks like an animal that way. Oh, I don't know. Anybody knows, put it in the comments. I haven't got a clue. Could be a Roman. Could be a button. Let me know. See you on this next one, guys. Uh, looks like it might be like the pin off a buckle or something. Might be quite an old one, though. It's got some detail on there. Yeah, I reckon it's part of an old buckle. Right, see you on the next one. There's the next one. Just a little pop end. Nothing fancy. Just a little bit of lead. On to the next. Alright guys, that's the end of that one. Uh, it's not a bad hunt in the end. Long old day. I was here from about half past nine till you know it's half five, so a good eight hours. Pretty knackered. Um yeah, got quite a few Romans off that last one. I have got about eight, eight or nine I think. There's a few I didn't film just because I got bored of filming quite your Romans with no detail on. Um what else I got? I've got a few bits. Weird little dog head thing, loads of lead. Um, not bad day though, nice to get loads of Romans. I don't mind if they've got any detail on, it's just nice isn't it, to get 2,000 year old coins still laying there. Um, feels good finding them, so hopefully get some more of some detail before it all gets seeded again, but we'll see, hopefully get a nice silver one as well, that'd be nice. Anyway, thanks for watching guys, like and subscribe, see you on the next one.